What's up everyone? My name is Emma and welcome to my channel Emma Kate. It is brand new. So I'm assuming you're also brand new so welcome. I thought I'd just get started and explain what I'm doing. As you can see by the title this is my 12 days of vlogmas. So basically most people if you don't know what vlogmas is. Vlogmas is basically Christmas vlog, vlogs about Christmas, vlogs during Christmas time, December, yada yada yada. Most people do vlogmas for the full 25 days leading up until Christmas but because I have a baby and I'm also in school I will not be doing 20 five videos one every single day that is definitely way too much so I thought instead I would do the 12 days of vlogmas self-explanatory I'll be doing 12 days of vlogmas I'll probably try and post every other day um, might be two days in between I'll try and keep it to just one day in between each vlog and I will be doing a lot of Christmas themed things so I'm gonna try and do things like how to wrap presents maybe how my Christmas recipes on a low FODMAP diet easy vegan healthy kind of baking recipes hot chocolates maybe some cooking dinner recipes if I feel like it. I'm gonna try and do some DIY Christmas presents and I'm also thinking about doing a videos about, I don't know, Christmas themed stuff. But for today's video, I thought I'd start it off and get into the Christmas spirit by doing my Christmas decorating. I got my Christmas tree, so come on and set up our Christmas tree with us. Happy December 1st! It's Christmas time! First Christmas! You have no idea what that means. This is Avery. And this is Rylan. AKA Baby Daddy. Day one of my first 12 days of Vlogmas. Day of Vlog, we were just gonna do some Christmas decorating and we were gonna put up our Christmas tree and it's basically just gonna be me bossing Rylan around how to do everything and I'll say, nope, that's wrong. Nope, move that, but I won't do any of the work. Welcome to our living room. We have this nice big living room, which is obviously where the Christmas tree is gonna go. We actually have these really tall, how tall are they? 14 foot ceiling. We have like all this empty wall space that we don't really ever know what to do with. I don't want to put anything too small in it because I feel like it just looks ridiculous otherwise. I think right now we have this space right in this, this corner right here. We have a door to our patio over here. Obviously we're not going on our patio because it's December. So I was thinking about putting the Christmas tree over here. That was my main thought because then when you're sitting on the couch you can see it. This is your first view when you walk into the apartment. You walk in from the, the kitchen so then it would be right there. You can see it. it would also be right by the window so everyone driving on the road will see it which I thought would be nice. My other thought is to put it right here where we currently have our big mirror. I don't know. Well, we'll have to see and set up the tree. I don't know actually how big it is. We stole it from Rylan's mom. Um, well, we didn't steal it. She gave it to us. Here, Avery, you push. Scary? You're not that scary. What do you think? <laughs> What's wrong, Bubba? <laughs> so we put the Christmas. Well, Rylan put the Christmas tree together. <laughs> I think we missed a piece. Just put it on the top. Tree topper. Oh, this is the bottom. <laughs> Took you that long to realize that? That seems better, doesn't it? What do you think your first Christmas tree? Want to touch it? Extremely impressed, aren't you? This is our first year ever having the tree, and somehow there is already an Emma hair on it. It's wonderful. Okay, so I went to HomeSense way back in November because they come out with stuff really early, and you know HomeSense, so you gotta snatch it up right at the get-go. I got these Christmas balls. If you haven't noticed from my place, I have very like warm, textured, neutral kind of colored things, so I kind of wanted to keep something along with the themes. I also got sparkly ribbon to put around the tree. I got two of these gold ones. And then I also got this rose gold pink one. Just went to Walmart and got 100 string of lights. That I got a green strand so it kind of blends in with the tree. But I also wanted white lights. I'm not really a fan of the colorful lights. If you haven't noticed, I'm very much a person who enjoys white and neutral. I'm not very colorful kind of a person. Oh, 
Putting the lights on the tree was very anticlimactic. The second half of the lights just uh, don't light up. Not the point in Christmas light. Well, that's annoying. Now I have to find the receipt and go back. I guess that's what I get for buying a $13 strand of lights. I'm not gonna spend a lot of money on Christmas lights. I just can't be bothered. Maybe I should be bothered because clearly $13 lights actually aren't that effective at being light. So that's fun. <sighs> I do not want to go out at all. I'm not going to have a half-lit Christmas tree because that's not very festive. So, off we are. And I also realize I actually do need to go out because my ornaments I got, they never come with the little hooks. And I forgot that I was going to go buy them. I realized I am also looking for a baby Santa hat because there is a picture of baby Emma right here. And I want to try and recreate it with Avery for her first Christmas because I think it would be adorable. My one errand somehow turned into errands, plural. Not super keen about that. I'm scared I forgot how to drive and I'm gonna doll 5,000 times. That's how long it's been since I haven't left the house. I did not realize that. Black Saturday, is that a thing? Sure, let's call it a thing. So far committed that, you know, we're gonna turn around. I just need my Christmas lights. Found the lights. For some reason now the box only has 70 lights instead of 100, but it's for the same price. Update, I'm done. They were different lights. I found the same box. Somebody help me. Where the heck can you find a baby Santa hat? I've been to Walmart, Carter's, every baby store. Please send help. Somebody comment below. I found some recyclable wrapping paper. Cause we love the environment. Ding. And then of course the infamous lights. But these things, I don't know what they're called. Ornament hangers. Unfortunately, they only come in packs of 150. How many did I need? Guess, how many? Four. Wait, don't look. How many's in the box? Four. You saw the number. He cheated, he saw the number. Yeah, I only need 40. I have 150 in case I lose a couple. So that was the worst. Don't ever go shopping on the Saturday after Black Friday in a pandemic. Would not recommend whatsoever. But the dude was done. She is ready for some. Um, festivities. Right, Avery? Woo woo! Oh, maybe, maybe we're not that excited for decoration. Um, so, funny story. We definitely need two strands. We all know how much I loved going out to get Christmas lights the first time. So why not do it twice? Hey, is that funny? <laughs> Excuse you! If you want to know what that sound was, it was this little lady doing a big bug. <laughs> <laughs> she missed her mommy. <laughs> I love that. It is the next day. I can't remember if I said this yesterday, but I went on my big excursion to get lights that worked. I got more lights. They do work. However, they do not cover the whole entire Christmas tree. Yes, I did have to go back for a third time. It was meant to be. You know why? Remember how I've been looking for a baby Santa hat? I found but now I have to go return the other lights because the light I originally got, these bad boys, they didn't have at this Walmart. And of course I'm gonna buy matching lights. I had to get a different set. But now I have to return those other ones cause I hate having things that I'm never gonna use. Now I'm gonna boss Rylan around to take the lights off cause I don't want to. Rylan. Ignore the messy kitchen. That's not my fault. It's your if you're wondering where Avery is, she is currently taking a nap. She did not start her nap in her crib. She started it in her high chair, her thumb in her mouth, pulling it like this. I don't know why that was comfortable, but she was out like a light. Damn, it feels good to be a gangster. Okay, I need help. Usually this candle is in that corner. Well, both these candles are in that corner, but you can't see them in that corner. I was either thinking, putting them here, because I feel like in the corner of the window, it looks cute from there, but then our couch is kind of in the way. If I walk around, you can see them kind of. My other thought was to put them where you can see both of them. Somebody help me, comment down below. A, in the corner, or B, in the middle. Help. Did you get different colors? <laughs> no. We did just take a strand of lights off. Could it maybe be a strand of lights that you just took off? 
boys. Now for the part that I'm dreading. As fun as it is to decorate a Christmas tree, I got these really pretty glittery decoration balls and we're gonna get glitter everywhere and i'm really not a fan of that but it's gonna look pretty <laughs> well i guess if you want to go to a strip club then you can easily cover it up and i'll just think it's from the christmas tree yeah you're not gonna be catching me at a strip club during a pandemic <laughs> Hopefully also not a glittery one. Just come home without any glitter. I think I would honestly be more mad if you went to a strip club and you came home and tracked glitter around the house. So note to self, you're gonna go to a strip club. No glittery bitches. Yeah, can I your private dance with your least glittery stripper? <laughs> I also made sure to get plastic ones because I have a baby. I don't really want to take my chances. Also, I have a boyfriend. Also, probably not a good idea to have glass balls with him because him and Avery ruin everything. He's been banned from drinking coffee in the living room because I don't know if you can tell. I like white. I have white pillows, a white blanket, a white rug, white, white, white. He brought coffee into the living room this morning even though he's not allowed to. And did he spill drops on the coffee table and the rug? Yeah. No. Yes. Mm. There's evidence right here. I'm honestly so annoyed that we have 150 of these bad boys and only 40 of these. Design some ornaments and I'll print them. Comment down below if you want 3D printed ornaments. Custom designs, DM us. Ta-da! Ready to go. Bing! Bing! <laughs> that was so lame. We're gonna change the sound effect, right? <laughs> I'll edit the sound effect. Ready? Wait. Now that is art. God, it was annoying to put all the hooks on these. So glad I only have to do this once. But they look pretty. Rylan has finished stringing the lights on the Christmas tree. He has done what we like to call the preliminary. Pre preliminary, I can't say it now. <laughs> say preliminary. It. He has done that on the Christmas tree and now I will go and actually fix it. We do the same thing with house chores. You go, this is dark. Look at the camera, it's supposed to be candid. Pretend it's not there. Hang it on? Yep. No, don't, don't eat it. <laughs> Dude, you have to let go. You put it on the tree, then you let go. She says, I, I really don't care about this whole Christmas thing. I'd rather look at the cars on the street. I'm kind of contemplating if it's meant to be for us to have a Christmas tree. We just put all the decorative balls on the Christmas tree and we forgot to put the ribbon on first. I'm really tired of decorating and undecorating and redecorating and undecorating this Christmas tree. So we're just gonna roll with it, hey Avery? <coughs> Now that we're done crying, I thought we'd show off our Christmas tree! We're not too happy about the Christmas tree, evidently. I actually ended up having too much ribbon, so... I just hung the remainder down the side of the tree, and yes, I shoved the extra roll right in the back of the tree. That's my temporary um, solution. I have commitment issues to cutting things, making permanent decisions. Not like relationship commitment issues, but like everything else. Thanks for decorating our Christmas tree with us. We have an artificial tree and I know there's some controversy on it, so comment down below if you go for the real Christmas tree or artificial. 
I'd be interested to see you. Thank you for watching day one of my 12 days of vlogmas. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss any more videos coming out. I'll be uploading them every other day. I'll make sure I upload enough so that there's 12 before Christmas. Give this video a like. It will really help support our channel. Bye, everyone. <laughs> You're so awkward. Yep. Let's just say I'm really glad that money in Canada is waterproof because we just washed our money, boys. Oh, dumb.